All right, YouTube, I've recorded this a couple of times, but uh, I screwed up and I didn't have my window in the right area for you guys to see what was going on. So if you're like me and you have a shared YouTube TV family plan, let's say that you're traveling abroad for an extended stay. Maybe you have a loving father who pays for YouTube TV like I do. And thus, his home area is lord and master of the rest of your geolocation. Well... I can tell you guys this right now. I'm not in San Francisco. Um, I'll show you where I am once we're done with this. But I need to, assuming that I want to keep using YouTube TV, i got to sign into the Eugene area. So I'm going to show you guys how to do this without a VPN, without any external apps. Just going to use the Chrome, Chromium Base, or Brave browser in my instance, which is also based on Chromium, the back end of Chrome. You could also use Microsoft Edge coming up soon because, you know, hell froze over and Microsoft's admitting their defeat. All right. Now, without wasting any more time, we're going to go into our developer tools. And we can see that we don't see what we're looking for, which we're looking for sensors. So I'm going to go down here to more tools just to get all of my options. And I'm going to go to sensors right now. So from sensors, you get a nice little thing called geolocation. Before we mess with any more of this, though, here's what I want to do. I want to clear my cache, because I have a feeling that our geolocation is stored in the cache like everything else. All right, with that out of the way, we're going to update our geolocation. So first, let's go to other. Now let's do Eugene Lat Long. Oh, look at that. Looks like I'd already done it. Now, we're going to throw 44052. And then we're going to do this. Make sure to include your negatives if you need them. Otherwise, you're going to get a wacky area. Now, now that we've set that Lat Long, update our playback area. Now, if it hangs up on you for too long, you can be just like me and be an impatient bastard, and we'll just force it to refresh. So, give it 10 more seconds. Eh, I lied. Fuck it. We're gonna do it now. We still have that geolocation service on. We might glitch things out for a second. We might get a little white screen where Google doesn't get our content area, but I've been doing this for the last couple of days, and uh, I wanted to, to give this information to Google formally. I filed a bug report, but they didn't consider this a bug or anything. So I'm telling you guys. Here, we got to be persistent for this. Oh man, you can tell this machine is chugging along here. It's not enjoying uh, recording and having all this content up. Might be time for an upgrade soon. And I swear guys, I'm not just stalling this out for a 10 minute video. I know most people take their sweet ass time. I'm just trying to be persistent to show you why you never want to give up. You don't want to accept defeat. You just want to keep trying to get your way. Because this is one of the few times in life where you can really do the art of negotiation. Most, most of the time it's not going to pan out well for people. Or it's illegal in many cases. But in this case, we're just trying to change our playback area so we don't lose our YouTube TV content access and Google can't expect us all to live right next to each other, man. I'm sorry. Alright, let's 
save this just in case. Let's close that out. Let's close this guy out. Let's clear our cache again just for shits and giggles. Let's pull our tools back up in a second here. Let's see. There you go. As you can see, with a clearing of the cache and a refresh, I've changed my content area to Eugene, which is exactly what we wanted to do. So now let's, oh, where am I looking? I'm not the best teacher, guys, I gotta show you. All right, so once this guy loads up and confirms that we are in, I mean, is, you can see up here that we are in Eugene. But let's say that we want to change our, our area back again. We're going to let this load up. And then we're going to change it again. And this time, since we've already covered that I started out in San Francisco, now I'm in Eugene. I'm going to just turn off the override. Eh, let's refresh the page again. Because why not? As you can see, we are in Eugene now. And I am no longer receiving that warning message, which is the whole point. Now we can keep watching our YouTube TV uninterrupted, but that's only half the battle. Now I'm watching content that's on, or the live TV channels, that is. I'm only watching them based on what the, the Eugene time zone and the Eugene broadcast services. So, here's what we're going to do. Persistent as fuck. We're going to clear our, our cache. We're going to reload YouTube. We're going to make sure that we don't have that content or that uh, geolocation override on. Then we're going to update our playback area again. Hopefully I can finish this before this Mac dies. But, uh... I don't even really need to do this. You guys understand that it worked, but just to illustrate a point and us go through everything. Let's refresh that one more time. Now let's update our location. And as it's updating, we'll probably have to refresh because YouTube TV's got a lot of a lot going on under the hood you can't see behind the scenes but we know as soon as you run it if you're on windows you can just control delete and look at how much of your your ram that is being consumed as if chrome wasn't consuming already in uh you know what four gigs youtube tv spikes it up a bit all right, we can tell that it's doing something because it hasn't refreshed yet, so let's reload this page. Pardon me. We can see it hasn't updated just yet. So. Let's refresh. Double check. Still hasn't changed. Clear cache one more time. Refresh YouTube. Let's 
let's try and update that that playback here one more time. Oh, fuck, I didn't, I didn't plug in my mic for this. All right, what is this, fifth time's a charm? Hopefully this works. Otherwise I'm gonna to have to reload the page again. What I do too in other circumstances is you can always just open up another Chrome instance browser if you've been messing with it too much. And if you update your playback area through that, that is also equally as effective. So in fact, I'll do that from another tab. go we got what we were looking for when it shows you that whole update with mobile because it can't determine your location that means that you're doing your job right you've got a whole bunch of obfuscated geolocation data probably stored in the cache that they won't actually clear so while we let this go let's just look up LA that long. There we go. And just to make sure, even though we could have done this the first time, I wanted it to read my. Oh, there we go. There it is. There's the Terminator. I know what I'm watching after this. All right, well, I had myself mic'd up the first time, and I fucking unplugged my mic like an idiot, so hopefully that you guys can hear me okay, because I'm not recording this a third or fourth time. All right, YouTube. Hope this helped. I don't care if you like but subscribe. I don't even care if you subscribe. I really just care if it helped you at all. If it didn't, then I don't know how the fuck you're finding me. Peace.